What's up guys and welcome back to Everything Gaming uh, and in today's video I'm going to help you guys complete every challenge in this week's Forzathon event in which you can win the Porsche 959 which is a very very sought after car you will see it in a lot of the forums people always trying to find one uh, or find someone to sell them so now is your chance to get it it is a fantastic car uh, but without further ado you know don't like wasting your time so let's get stuck into the first challenge which wants you to complete an online adventure to win the Porsche 959 next one wants you to win a race in Alancia to win 60 thousand credits third one wants you to complete a championship in the porsche 959 you won earlier to earn three wheel spins and the last one just wants you to perform 15 drift skills to receive 35,000 xp all very very easy challenges here uh, so we'll start with the first one which wants you to complete an online adventure to win the porsche 959 so you go across to your social tab here uh, and click on online adventure now you can click on the top one which will take you into a random adventure which could be games or races uh, or you could select a custom one where you can pick racing only or games only or racing without contact which is just everyone's a ghost car so no one can knock you off the track uh, and do a championship that way now in order to get the Porsche 959 you need to do a championship and online one from the first event to the last event now you have to complete each and every race in those events doesn't matter where you finish you do not have to win that online championship you could come in th uh, first fourth or tenth it really does not matter it doesn't matter how many people are in there or what car you're using just complete all four events in an online championship get to the very end and then you'll win the Porsche 959. So that is a very, very easy challenge. It won't take you too long at all. Next one, just wants you to win a race in Alancia to win 60,000 credits. Now, you can pick whichever Lancia you want. It does not matter. I went for my Stratos HF Group 4. Normally go for the Delta, but I thought I'd change it up a little bit. Now, you can pick whatever race you want. I went for my Highway Circuit because it's a very quick and easy one. I do recommend you modify your Lancia a bit tune it up a bit make it a bit quicker uh, but bear in mind for this challenge you do need to win the race to get 60,000 credits so it will not work if you come second or tenth again you need to come in first for that one uh, third challenge wants you to complete a championship in the Porsche 959 that you won earlier to earn three wheel spins now I always go to the highway circuit to start my championships as you can see I've rocked up in the Porsche 959 of which if you guys do not have one obviously you'll complete the first challenge and then you'll have it to complete the third one this time the championship is in single player so not an online one pick three races very short and very easy ones doesn't matter which ones just make sure you cross the finish line in all three in the Porsche 959 and again it doesn't matter where you finish for this one so unlike the second one where you have to come in first it doesn't matter where you cross the line in any of these races you can come in last place or first place or fifth place really does not matter just cross that finish line on all three events within the championship and as you can see there, the championship complete screen. You want that to show up and then you'll have three wheel spins at your disposal. Now the last challenge wants you to perform 15 drift skills to earn 35,000 XP. So I recommend coming up here to the airfield and I will show you why in a second. I know there's no twisty bends on it, uh, but it is very, very simple. And as you can see, I'm still on my 959. And what I basically do is just drift in a weaving pattern up and down the airstrip. Now, most of you guys probably would have got a few of the drift skills during the races. It really depends on how you roll, how you take those corners, whether you take them accurately or whether you just like to power slide around them. Now, you can use a four-wheel drive car or rear-wheel drive or front-wheel drive if you really dare. It does not matter at all. Just make sure you get 15 drift skills. It's a very, very easy challenge. And going up and down the airstrip, you probably get about seven, eight skills, uh, drift skills in one run if you're going very quick taking your time you'll probably get about 11 12 if not more you could probably do it in one run on the airstrip so very very easy challenges there now i know that i'm obviously doing guides for certain easy challenges and it's rare that a really hard one comes along uh, and you guys are probably pros at this game right now let's be honest uh, but i do still like making these helpful guides just in case some of you guys need a bit of clarification on certain sort of skills etc or just a little bit of a helping hand it doesn't matter or even if you actually like enjoying these videos you know i don't know if most of you do i probably don't to be honest i wouldn't if i was in your shoes um but anyway a massive thank you for you guys that do and a massive thank you for everyone's support it really does mean a lot to me uh, i hope you guys will stay tuned because obviously 28th september i will be getting forza horizon 4 uh, i get the ultimate edition so i get it a bit early um, so obviously i'll be releasing as many helpful videos as possible on that for you guys but again a massive thank you for everyone's support i hope you enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to drop a like and stay tuned for more just like this but a massive thank you and good luck winning the porsche 959